Oh wow! Wow. What a scene. Well, I love one of the one of the scenes I love is the um, sort of cyborg um, learning his powers scene, where he uh, we kind of go on sort of a journey of discovery with him to figure out what he can do now that he's cyborg, and I think that that's really fun and, and sort of. Uh, I think fans should get a kick out of that and just sort of see his heart, what he's really about. Take your place among the brave ones. I'm not broken. And I'm not alone. And I think my favorite scene is the Flash and Iris scene. Oh, yeah. Because we get to introduce Iris and we get to see Flash's superpowers. And I think it's a really fun juxtaposition, like, with this very emotional music and the hot dogs. And um, it was a scene that we've we've always liked. And, and it's yeah. funny, because I think that there have been just recently some press saying that we cut it out of the movie. And I think when we left, we actually started the movie with that scene in one iteration of it. So yeah. that's really false information yeah, that's being reported out there. I want you to listen to me, Barry, because I mean this. I'm putting together a team, people with special abilities. You can be whatever you want to be. I can't sit here and watch you run in place. You'll have to run faster than you've ever attempted. I would say uh, epic space opera. <laughs> Heroic journey. I was gonna say epic too. Did you say home? Home? <laughs> epic journey home. Epic journey home. <laughs> okay, it's pretty obvious. Uh, for me, it's Wonder Woman. Um, I think what's amazing about this character, I mean, I, I grew up with this character more so than with comics. Like she was always a part of my life. So to be able to bring her to the screen for the first time and now see her become a Wonder Woman to the world is amazing. But I think what's so great about her is she embodies um, so many things, you know, and um, she's very multidimensional. Um, so, she, you know, she can be vulnerable and, you know, she's all about love, but she's also about strength. And, you know, she's a fierce warrior and she could be not just one of those things, but all of those things. That's a great answer. I think they're all like my children. It's hard to decide, but um, I do, and you know, not to, double down on cyborg but i really feel like the cyborg story is like sort of it really sort of uh, parallels the story of the film in a lot of ways and so you know it, it naturally to me is the one that i i think i gravitate more toward we're super excited to have it on sky so thanks for hosting us. <laughs>